How's it? Today is Wednesday, November 16th. It is a back squat, clean and jerk work in the overhead press day. As you can see, I am not lifting at central strength. I'm at uh, Sunnyvale 24 hour fitness. I'm lifting with Becca today. Um, so that's exciting. It's super early. It's, um, I think on that clock there, it says it's like six something but I am actually flying home today for a wedding that's coming up on Sunday and um, I'm very excited about that so I thought it would be well Becca actually asked me if I wanted to lift on Wednesday before I leave and that actually seemed like the better idea just because I don't want to lift after um, my sitting on the plane for five and a half hours um, but yeah I am doing uh, most of my stuff today. It's just in pounds, so 275 here. The number was supposed to be 126, which is, I think, 277. But um, 125 is 275, and then I have one. Uh, I put the clips on there, which is about half a kilo together. So not quite um, 277, but somewhere close, as close as I could get to it. And these are actually getting very difficult. I think positionally on my tempo ones, I'm okay. But when I get to full tempo, some of them are a little bit out of position. And I am not happy with that. I don't think it is a function of me lifting in the morning. I think it is just a function of it being super, like, not heavy, but getting to the point where it is heavy. Um, after that I was supposed to do uh, power clean plus two hang cleans um, which I did change I think was it last week or two weeks ago I, I don't remember at this point whatever the case is um, it was supposed to be at 111 so that's 242 and I didn't want to round down for that one so I rounded up and I just was simply unable to execute those lifts so um, here's my last set by the way for the squats so again, one plus nines here. And I often lose count on these, so um that's two, three, four, five, six. You can see here I'm struggling. Seven. Eight, and then this one more here. I'm talking to Becca. I also can't hear what she's saying. I don't know why I did that. <laughs> I should think in the video she says that's it, but I I thought it was one more left, and I'm glad I did because I looked back and that was correct. Um, but yeah, going back to my clean movement here. So warming up on these power cleans felt really awesome. At least with 135. I don't think that 135 has felt like that in a very long time. The hand cleans leave a little bit to be desired, but um, I thought with that first set that I would be able to do the 245 for the power clean plus two hand cleans. And um, my confidence quickly went away when I went up to 185, and that 185 power clean was um, a little bit of a struggle. Here's my 225. Just a little warm up, so I don't do the whole um, two hand cleans here. And then I go to 235, I believe. Yeah, so again, 111 is 242. I end up trying it with 245. And I am just simply unable to do the power clean. And I uh, eventually, like that is not even close to a power clean there. I do one hand clean on this one here, and then I believe I give up on the third one, if I recall. Yeah, look at me barely sneaking under that. That's ridiculous. I was going to pick it up again, but my thumbs were just like, nah, negative Ghost Rider. Um, and then this is a full clean. And I'm just, uh, you know, my morale has been destroyed. So I switched that up to um, one clean plus two hand cleans. 
at 245, which I think is still pretty um, sizable as far as like how much I've cleaned recently. Um, it's it kind of mirrors what I did on Monday, right? Because Monday I, I was unable to do my um, power snatch, so I ended up doing one snatch plus um, two hang snatches. I was trying to do three hang snatches, but I did did not um, complete those. So I reattempted this at uh, Becca's uh, decision. <laughs> I was like, should I do it again? Um, I didn't know if I should or not, but then she said, yeah, why not? And then this here, this, watch me sneak under this, barely. <laughs> Very lucky that I'm uh, quick under. My timing was um, a little bit too quick to drop under. And then after that, I actually omitted my my clean um, pulls because I knew that I would be sitting on the airplane for five and a half hours um, shortly after this, and I didn't want to be uncomfortable and I didn't want to be hurting uh, simply from the airplane, you know. So I, I moved over straight into overhead presses. Um, tried my best to do a set of five at 67, but uh, 67 is unloadable. I think 67 is like 147 or 148 or something like that. Um, so I went up to 150, and I was unable to do a set of five, but uh, I did do a set of six. Oh, sorry, that's not true. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. A set of four at uh, 150. Um, with the warm-ups, I didn't think I was going to be able to do even two, so uh, pretty surprised myself with that. I also did um, clean every single of these... Um, reps before the press so that definitely didn't help with the top set and um, I know that that's an issue but well I was too stubborn to take it from the rack and walk it all the way out here um, yeah here's my top set at 150 this is exceedingly difficult and then I actually try to do a, a few down sets after this but um, I get the biggest quad cramp of my life. I actually haven't felt a cramp um, in a training session like that. Um, I don't think ever. It, it definitely happens when I'm lifting <laughs> at uh, meets and whatnot, but never in a training session like this. So um, Becca said, that's it right here. And my left leg, oh, 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 oh. Um, and then after that, I finished off with um, some dips and no back extensions, again, for the same reason why I didn't do any pulls today. But yeah, that's all for today. Um, I'm very happy I was able to lift with Becca. Um, but yeah, going home soon. Thank you for watching. Shoots.